recently i've developed this feeling that you know i don't want to be attached to anybody in life why because there's a scare in me that any point of time in life if they leave me i would be hurt to not feel hurt i want to be detached is this thinking of mine right and what is it that i can do to feel detached well there's nothing uh, wrong actually uh, to feel detached actually uh, this is you know something which uh, our uh, sages have recommended that one should be detached to things in life and the, but to feel detached actually we need to understand a few things because attachment is the opposite of detachment right so attachment brings with itself a certain amount of pleasure and joy and pain of course correspondingly and hurt so to feel detached one has to transcend above this feeling of uh, uh, pleasure and pain now uh, to give you an example let's say you were very attached to your let's start with object attached to a car you know you it's a brand new car and you just bought it and you know you maintain it very nicely and keep it together and, and somebody scratches your car and you feel hurt right but he has not scratched you why would you feel hurt Be- because it has scratched something you are attached to if you would not if it is not your car and somebody else's car was being scratched it wouldn't matter to you at all so it is your attachment to things which gives you pain like you rightly said and will give you hurt and the joy and the pleasure which it gives is only temporary a car you only buy a new car yes it gives you some pleasure and joy it will be a temporary pleasure and joy after 6 months the one year you're looking at new car you're checking out oh this is a new model i need to change it and need to buy something new so that is all temporary the joy and pleasure but the pain and the hurt can be truly damaging and i can understand where you come from you know when you say that uh, is this thinking of mind right to be detached because somehow uh, in the society we have uh, um, equated detachment with not caring actually nothing can be further from the truth true caring can only happen when you are detached to even take the example of the car i just gave if you were detached from this object of yours and somebody scratched your car you will evaluate it the damage you will not get angry you will not get upset and by angry and upset of course you hurt yourself only so you will not hurt yourself by getting upset and angry you will analyze the damage what it will cost me go to the, the mechanic get it repaired get it fixed and end of story you know there is a logical way of handling it even when we are attached to somebody we love which is much closer to us and, you know this is what you really what you're asking about this question let's say mother is very attached to her child does it mean she really love her child and she can really take care of her child let's say now the child gets hurt for any reason he falls he bleeds he's bleeding his wound is bleeding and the mother because she is so attached to the child she cannot think straight she is crying with the baby however the detachment would mean that she loves that child but she is not letting that child affect her because that child if she realizes this child is not really hers but it's a gift which has been given to her to take care of she would look for some medicine put that medicine on this her child and make him okay and love that child but in her grief because as if a part of hers has got hurt because she is so attached to this thing she cannot take care of it because this thing becomes an extension to her so of course to be detached and yet to love and to care is uh, actually to love and care is only truly possible when you are detached otherwise it's not possible so you can do this but you have to rise above this uh, 
you know, feeling uh, the duality of pleasure and pain. 